Hey everyone, it's Craig Reckless. Um, today's lesson is going to be called Don't You Forget About Me. Uh, it's a song by Simple Minds. Yeah, it's by them. Um, so, um, so what this is going to be, it's going to be my version of how I play it. So uh, we'll call it a punked up version because um, this song is uh, a pretty big production. It's got like organs and one guitar is going something like that all the way through the whole song. But uh, we're going to do my version and I'm going to show you how I do it. Okay. So it's going to go. dramatic I am but I just wanted you to know that is the song we're doing the hey hey, hey song um but so we're gonna go so now these are gonna be again so the, um if you're just starting out um these are gonna be on uh, my bar chord video and my learning how to play bass notes and bar chords um so check those videos out if you aren't uh ouch familiar with any of this stuff so. So we're playing D to E, which is the 5th fret to the 7th fret. Now I'm going to go. We can play E minor there. But I like the little harmonic there. Then we're going to go C to D. We're going to go. Play the E minor because I don't, don't want to do a harmonic twice, so I'm gonna go E minor, then the C to D again. Okay, so that's the intro, and then, then it's gonna go. Okay, so what we're doing there, we're, we're going E to D to A. I'm Scale one, which is sixth fret. So back and forth, we're just going. Okay, so you you keep it straightforward as you want to. Okay, I'm showing you how to punk it up. But I like to chug it a little different. I like to do, I almost like to chug it a little funky, like the uh, that little guitar that's actually going on in a real song. There's like something going dun, 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 the whole time. Okay, so you do that the whole verse. Okay, so then we get to the chorus. I'm gonna. I'm gonna add uh, what they call arch tops. Is what, what the arch tops are is we're playing the last notes of the uh, bar chord open. So usually it's the first, second. Um, it's usually just the first and second strings that are open. So what I'm so what I'm gonna do there? I'm gonna be going. <laughs> So what I'm doing, I'm going to play the E to the D to the A to the D again, just like we have before. Okay, but now we're mixing it up, we're making the chord a little different, like adding the arch chops. Like I said, I'm all about dynamics, like, um, you know, if you're writing a song or covering a song, you, you should, you, you know, come down for the verse so the, everybody hears the singer singing so you come down that's why I, I muted when I'm doing the uh, uh, verse and then when I play the chorus let's bam we're, we're jumping up the dynamic a little bit and we're playing <laughs> So to get this um, arch top, for all you guys that don't know, um, I'm going to have my first finger on the 7th fret, 
And the third finger is going to be on the ninth fret. The pinky is going to be on the uh, ninth fret. Okay, so the, 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 these are going to be on the uh, fourth string and third string. And then these are open. Second and first strings are open. And we're going to go to the D. We're playing the D, and we're going to have the second and first strings open. See that? Then we're playing the A. It's the A bar chord, but we're picking up our first finger and we're getting the second and first strings open. So we're playing that, the whole chorus. Okay? And then after that, it goes C. on the album, but I'm going to add my punk to it, I'm going to go... flavor you want to your it's your song now okay so after that does the C to the G to the D to the A twice it's gonna do that two, two, two times all right now then we're gonna go back to the intro <laughs> Again, then we're gonna do the chorus again, all right, and then I think um, after the chorus this time, okay, yeah, so it's playing the verse and the chorus again, and then uh, I think the only next, the only other part that it does is uh, there's a, a guitar part that goes. See how, see how boring that is? So that's what we're doing now. Before I tell you how boring it is, we're going to play uh, the first strings. Everything's going to be on the first string. So it's going to be 12 to 10 to 9 to 10. Okay, so it does that how many times you figure it out. It's so that, I mean, you got to do some homework on this. So it's going to be, any, I'm, it's, I'm guessing it's anywhere to four to eight times. So, um. But, uh, you know, listen to it and, and make this your song. So now when you do that, you want to either, if you have a whammy bar, give it a little. You know what I'm saying? Not too much, but uh, give it a little flavor because you want to make it, you know, not just. You see the difference? If you don't have a wave bar, just give it a little vibrato. Okay, and then after, so after it does that, it goes back into. So that's the chorus chords again with the arch tops. So that's what I'm doing. But it's doing that na 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 part. Okay, and then. Um, after that part, it does uh, it does the intro again, and then we end it. So it's That's it. So we don't make it to it.
it ending. Have a good day.